with some versions of the Samsung Galaxy S6 expected to feature the Exynos 7420 under the hood, the chip was seemingly the subject of a benchmark test at the Geekbench site. The single-core score was 1,520 and multi-core tally was 5,478. The test scores were most likely the result of a Samsung Galaxy S6 prototype that went through the benchmark test. You might have noticed the 1.5 GHz clock speed on the listing. This is probably the result of the slower Cortex-A53 being in use. The big dot little chip uses the latter cores for slower. Less intensive tasks while the Cortex-A57 handles the more heavy-duty jobs. One interesting note. According to the benchmark test, the Samsung Galaxy S6 prototype was equipped with 3GB of RAM despite speculation that the model would come with 4GB of the sweet stuff. Of course, if this is a prototype, there still is a chance that Sammy could squeeze 4GB of RAM into the final version. Although the N22 benchmark test also revealed 3 gigabytes of RAM inside the Galaxy S6. The version of the Galaxy S6 that went through that benchmark test was powered by the Snapdragon 810 CPU. Thank you for watching please subscribe for more reviews. And I will see you guys in my next video until then goodbye.